hearts unless I am singing. And then they are screeching. Oh, we have a little kitty. And I think she doesn't like singing. Okay, well, anyway, uh, there's my uh, Susan Boyle impersonation. Of course, this would be this would be Dumplin', who's not too happy to be hearing my uh, my singing voice. But she does like me, even though I try to put her on TV occasionally. She's happier now than a minute ago when I was singing loudly into her ears. Although that's in somewhat of a cat's register. Um, so how the heck are you doing? I usually uh, start out by asking that question. And there's a cat that's uh, playing with my paper background back there. Um, and uh, I am D.W. Wanberg, and this is D.W. Show for the 25th of May in the year of 2009. And, uh, oh boy, uh, what did I do yesterday? Uh, I, I didn't even talk about it last week, um, but I, I ran the marathon um, yesterday, and... Uh, uh, was I fast like the wind? He who flies like the wind. No, that that's not me. I'm I'm a big, slow, white guy, kind of lumbering along there. Um, but I did finish it. I uh, I finished every marathon that I entered, and uh, oh boy, uh, yeah, like a when was it? Um, maybe three weeks ago, something like that. I was uh, checking out the website, and they said. Uh, 75 uh, places left and I was kind of panicking a little bit and uh, uh, because I like to actually go down and plop down the cash uh, uh, in person and even though uh, and I, I missed it by two days it would have been 10 bucks cheaper but I, but I figure like if I really injure myself I don't want to put down the registration fee uh, not to go through with it but uh, anyway so I put down like 96 bucks to enter this race and uh yeah a little bit a uh, little bit pricey for me but i did it anyway um but i ran the marathon and uh, and do i have video clips can we run the clips you know i really like to run my clips at the end of the show so uh so maybe i'll do that uh, but i really should run them now but but then i i won't have the clips to to go to at the end of the show um and uh actually look i'm looking at the time and i'm actually like slightly ahead of schedule uh uh talking about the time what were my stats here as i said uh i'm a big slow guy um relatively i mean actually i, I can sprint kind of fast but over 26.2 miles uh, that's a little bit long distance. Um, my time was 5 hours, 13 minutes, and 37 seconds. And uh, actually, that's I'm, I'm not sure which time you go by, because that's the time from the starting gun until I lo uh, crossed over the finish line. Now they've got these little chips, which I don't know why I don't have it here, but... Uh, this was the first year they they let you keep the chips. They encourage you to recycle them, but uh, in past years they uh, they were going to charge you thirty five dollars if you lost or kept the chip. But uh, and when why did I, did I keep the chip? I, I'm not sure. Well, it was easier than untying my shoes, I guess. Um, but uh, but anyway. Uh, so what was that? Oh, the chip, my chip time was uh, 5 hours, 12 minutes, and 18 seconds, which was, let's do the quick math here, and I don't think I can do the quick math, because uh, that's, uh, uh, um, <laughs> that would be a, a minute and 19 seconds, um, uh, 
that it took me to get from my starting place when the gun went off past the 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 starting line. I mean, because I obviously I wasn't lined up with the guys um, that were uh, uh, ahead of the game. I mean, there was uh, a guy, I guess, um, and uh, I didn't write down his name, um, but was from Madison. Should I take a guess at his name? No, uh, Larry Smukba? Uh, I don't know. Uh, no, it, that wasn't his name. I, I can tell you that um, that wasn't his name, whatever I said. Um, but he, I remembered his time, uh, two hours, uh, 26 minutes, which was uh, uh, a bit less than half my time. So as uh, I was... Uh, Oh, actually, my, my half time was uh, 2 hours, um, 23 minutes, and 16 seconds. So, um, as, as I uh, crossed the halfway point in the marathon, which would be 13.1 miles, uh, this guy was uh, about 3 minutes away from finishing. Um, so, he was quite a distance ahead of me. Um, the first marathon that I ran, um, and I'm not even sure when it was. Uh, I've got to research that. I've, my thought is that I've done 12 of them, but maybe 13 with this one. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, that might be right. Maybe I've done 13, including yesterday's. I, maybe I could figure that, that, figure that out. I, I, I may have lost some of the medals or misplaced them, um, so I don't know. If by counting them and but anyway anyway um the first the first marathon that i did uh didn't really know how to train right for it and it had not run the whole marathon distance um in training um and and i started out thinking you know i was running to race running to race here running to win so i uh my first my first mile was a, a six minute um, and some second miles, and again, there was a uh, distance um, from the start line uh, uh, to where I started, so it was uh, close to I uh, close to six minutes, or maybe even less than six minutes. I don't know um, my first mile, and then uh, I had a fast second mile, and maybe uh, um, there were these folks at the beginning of the race that were saying, a Vaseline, anybody want Vaseline? And I wondered, why would anybody want Vaseline? And then, then I found out um, later on why somebody would want Vaseline. And uh, that, is, that was a bit uncomfortable, the, the chafing, severe chafing of, uh, of my legs. Um, and uh, an area you really don't want chafed. Um, but anyway, uh, so now I'm, I'm, I lube up everything uh, liberally. My, the armpits, you know, you, those chafe. Uh, nipples, the first race that I, uh, that I ran, my nipples were all chafed. Um, and also the first race that I ran, I ran in these really old... Um, running shoes i i was uh and and that was kind of this weird perverted way that i got into the race because uh um once i told somebody well you know i race in the marathon um, I, um but I, I don't have any good shoes and so right then they just rolled me out a check and uh and for a while they didn't have the madison marathon and then they started having it again and i thought by golly, I'm going to run in this Madison Marathon in those shoes. And uh, by that time, it was they actually took a break uh, in the Madison Marathon for two or three years where they didn't have it. And uh, so I thought, I'll, I'll run in this race. Um, and so I did, 